The Intensity preset within Mosaic Designer 2 provides static and dynamic control of intensity within all of the fixtures. Once it's applied to a timeline, you have the ability to configure its properties. Inside of the properties for intensity, you have the option for level. If it's a color mixing fixture, you can actually set color temperature, and then you get some effects. Underneath this dropdown for shape, you'll find sine, cosine, square, triangle, and ramp up. These are dynamic effects that can exist to control the intensity of a fixture only. So if I set a sine effect, I then get the ability to do size, loop, which could either be a period or a count. And what this is setting is how often I repeat the effect, whether I do it every one second, or if I set it to count, whether I set it so it repeats a certain amount of time within the overall length of the effect. When I play this effect, we'll now see my lights will go all the way up, and then come back down, and then go up again. If I alter the size here, we'll see a more dramatic change in lights. If I change my shape, we'll see a different type. When I go down to offset style, I get to choose what lights are being affected, whether the entire group, or whether they're chasing each other or following. So if I set this to spread, we'll now see the effect arch throughout all of the different lights. I then have the option to reverse the effect, changing its direction. Lastly, I can set the repeat and buddy options for the effect.